Hello and welcome to The Sacred Path. You know, I never get tired of reading Acts chapter 2, one of those beautiful chapters in the New Testament. Of course, the Holy Spirit comes upon the church, the church is birthed, and they're all speaking in tongues, and people gathered around from all different nations are hearing them give praise to God in their own language. It's just this amazing thing, right? But it needs an explanation. So here's what I love, that God is a redemptive God. So this is what the scripture says in chapter 2, verse 14. But Peter, taking his stand with the eleven, raised his voice and declared to them, Men of Judea and all who live in Jerusalem, let this be known to you and give heed to my words. For these men are not drunk, as you suppose, for it's only the third hour of the day. But what this is was spoken through the prophet Joel. And he goes on to quote uh, Joel's prophecy about the Spirit coming upon young men and old women, etc. So here's what I love about this. Peter came through a pretty rough time. Remember that? He denied Jesus three times, the cock crowed, and the whole thing. It got pretty dark there for Peter. He spent days just crying and weeping because of his failure. Here's what I want you to hear today on the sacred path. God is a redeeming God. It doesn't matter if you blow it, if you mess up, somehow you get your feet dirty in sin. Here's what can happen. You just simply repent. He said, God, I'm sorry. I confess my sin before you. Would you embrace me again? And the embracing arms of God are there because he never really left you. So today, understand and know that Peter was a redemptive character and you can be as well.